This is the Roulette Master, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe by hitting the red subscribe button in the lower right hand corner. Also, ring that bell for notifications because I have new content releasing every single day of the week at 9 a.m. Today's video was sent to me by one of my subscribers, Manos M, and this is his system. As always, let me know if you like it, if you don't like it, or if you would modify the system. And let's go ahead and get started. So, let's go ahead and just put a bet on red for $10. And the key to his system is the progression. You could do this with any of the um, outside bets or inside bets. But he stays at $10 until he gets a loss and then a win. So I'm going to use any of these outside bets right now just to demonstrate his progression. Okay, we won there. Let's go 19 to 36. So it's going to take a loss and then a win to increase the unit size from 10 to 20. There's another win there. Let's go to odd. Get a few losses here so I can show you how it works. And then after you get a win and then, or after you get a loss and then a win, then you will, if you're still in a negative, he says, that you increase the unit again. So there's a loss. And so let's see if we can get a win after a loss. And we did. So he says when you get a win after a loss, and then uh, you increase by one unit. So let's. Uh, Let's go for black for $20. Okay, and we got it. Then we would go back to $10. But if you won after a loss and you checked and you were at a, at, at a negative situation with your balance, then you would increase it again to from 20 to 30 dollars so you would increase the unit one more time but let's keep playing and i'll show you more of how his system works but we're back to ten dollars now because we um, won after a loss and we were still in profit okay we we just uh lost on that one and we won the time before so Okay, so let's see if we get a win out of this next one. Okay, we lost again there. So we need a win after a loss to increase it. So let's, let's go odd again. And I see what he's getting at here with um, the increasing it if you're not in a positive balance because if you get a bunch of losses in a row and okay there's a win after a loss so we increase from 10 to 20 let's go red I'll try to explain that better okay and we lost so at this point, we would stay on that $20 until we get a win. So, and then at that point, when we do get the win, if we're in a negative, we increase. Okay. But we're still in a positive balance, so let's go back to $10. Let's go 1 to 18. Okay, we lost. So let's try to get a win after a loss, which increases the bet from 10 to 20. And we did, we got a win after a loss. So now we go to 20. And let's go, let's stay on one to 18 actually. So 
Okay, and we lost that one. So we stay on that amount until we get a win. And let's go. So we stay on 20 till we get a win. Okay, so we stay on 20. And then we wait to increase it until we actually get that win. So stay on 20. And I think we're going to be at a deficit by the time this one wins. Because there's another loss. So we stay on 20. And if that happens, then we're supposed to increase it again. Okay, another loss. So we stay on the 20. Another loss. So lots of losses here. We might have to think about switching our bet, but let's go one more time on 1 to 18. Okay, and we got a win. So now it's time to increase the bet from 20 to 30 because we're definitely in a deficit now. So here we go at $30. And then he says that you keep stay on that number until you get back in the positive. So we're still in the negative. So that means we stay on 30 until we get positive again. Okay. Okay, and we're definitely we're in the positive for the overall again. So uh, let's go back to ten dollars again. And basically, this way you can uh, decide when you want to cash out because it definitely uh, goes through a few cycles. Okay, so we lost 10, we lost 10. Let's go even for 10. And we got it. So we had a win after a loss. And so that means we double from 10 to 20. Okay, and we won. So we have positive earnings again, so we go back to $10. And I'm kind of learning this as I go, just like you guys are. I uh, just received this one today. So uh, it seems to be a money management system for sure, because I notice it's very safe. But at the same time, it doesn't make a lot of earnings because as long as you're in profit, you go back. So there's another loss. And I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys think of this and see if there's a modification we could make to this. Or maybe I'm not doing it exactly the way he's saying, and we'll find that out as well. But this is um, what he's telling me is that he only increases the win after a loss. And we won that one, so it's time to increase. And we're in $10 profit right now, but we always increase after when we win after a loss. So let's go, let's go 19 to 36 for 20. That's the main rule with this. You always increase when you win after a loss. Okay, but then if you lose, you stay on that amount until you become... Um, positive again so that means we stay on 20 and we just stay on 20 until we get a win then we increase so let's go 20 again
and we lost again so let's switch it up here let's go well I think we'll go one more time on 19 to 36 okay so there's a win after a loss so we're gonna increase from 20 to 30 and let's go let's go black and we're definitely in a deficit now but not a huge deficit because there definitely is some money management to this system okay so we're definitely not in a deficit anymore we're at zero but i think that counts it so that counts as not being behind so that means you start back over at 10. as long as you're not negative you start back over and then basically then you need to cash out when you're ahead and we just lost there okay we lost again this is definitely a way you could play for a very long period of time um, and uh, not a lot of risk so there's a there's a win after a loss. Now we're down 10. So the next bet's going to be 20. And let's go 19 to 36. Okay, and we we won after we increased and we're in positive, so we go back to $10 again. And here we go. But if we had been negative, we would have increased by another unit. Okay, there's a loss. Let's go black again for $10. Okay, and there's a win after a loss. So now we go, we increase from 10 to 20. Okay, and we won, so we check and see if we're negative or positive. And we're not negative anymore, so we start back at 10. So this is very interesting. It seems like you could play this all day and, um, and not risk a lot of money. And then you could just wait till you get up and cash out. But at the same time, it doesn't make a lot of money quickly. Um, but this would appeal to a lot of people that just are tired of losing and uh, want to play a long time and... Um, with less risk for sure so there's a loss so in theory here if you lost eight in a row you'd lose 80 bucks and then when you did win finally you would increase and if you were still negative you would increase again so that last one we got a win after a loss so it's time to increase to 20 and we're getting the hang of this more now the more we play so hopefully you guys are getting the hang of it too and I uh, look forward to your comments and uh, there's a win so now we're at $50 um, we start back over again because we uh, increased it in one when we won after a loss so we're back to 10 again but like I was saying I hope you um, let me know if you have any modifications for this uh, definitely a very interesting system it has a lot of money management uh, stuff going on with it. We're up 60 now and Keeps you definitely keeps you from losing a lot the way that it um, Makes you reset consistently And I'm interested how it does when you have a lot of losses in a row and and there's two losses in a row So now let's go let's go 19 to 36 There's three losses in a row. Let's go 19 to 36 again. I do like the idea that you're not losing a ton when there's a lot of losses in a row. And there's another loss. So we've had a bunch of losses in a row now. Let's see how many losses in a row we can get and see if we can come back. Okay, there's a win after a bunch of losses. 
So now we would increase to 20. And let's go ahead and bet on black for 20. Then we'll see if we're in the positive or negative still. And we won, which would reset us if we were positive. And we are positive, so we would go back to $10. So even after all those losses, I'm still ahead. So I'm liking what I'm seeing here, but I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys think. Um, definitely a good money management system, like I was saying. And uh, very interested to put some more time into playing this and seeing how it works over a long period of time. Okay. And even though it is hard to get up a lot, we're up $70 right now. And uh, I could see that if you got a bunch of wins in a row, that'd be time to cash out for sure. So um, anyway, hope you guys like this one. But let me know if you like it, don't like it, or would modify it. And uh, thank you, Manos M, for sending this one in. I appreciate it. And uh, definitely looks like a good system. So um, also, if you guys have any systems of your own, please send them in to me. I love getting new systems and trying them out on the channel and then uh, just testing them. And the uh, main thing is I love the interaction between um, all the subscribers and me and the subscribers between each other. I, I like how you guys are um, interacting with each other now and I think that's great for, for everybody so we can get the best roulette systems possible. And I hope, hope you like this one and um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please uh, hit the red subscribe button in the lower right hand corner. Also ring that bell for notifications because I have new content releasing every single day of the week at 9 a.m. This is the Roulette Master and have a great day.